It occurred to me as I was putting the finishing touches on my mission control video that I did not demonstrate how to close these spaces in mission control. So that's what this video is all about. Now if you have not already seen my mission control video, please check my YouTube channel to learn more about how to use mission control. As you can see, I currently have mission control open on my computer and I have three different spaces, desktop one, Safari, and desktop two. If I go ahead and hover my mouse over one of these thumbnails, such as desktop two, I see an X in the upper left corner of the thumbnail. When I click on this X, that space disappears. And whatever app was opened up in that space, in this case Finder, has been brought over to another space. In this case, it was brought over to Desktop. And the reason it was brought over to Desktop and not Safari is because Safari, as a space, is a full screen app, as you can see. At this point, I'm going to go ahead and exit out of the full screen view of Safari by hovering in the upper right corner and clicking on the arrows. And now as you can see, Safari has been brought out of full screen view. When I go back to Mission Control, Safari has now been brought into the same space as Finder. In fact, I can see Finder and Safari are both here. When I click on the desktop thumbnail, you'll see that there's Safari, there's Finder. So when it comes to closing an actual space, you simply go ahead and hover over the space that you want to close. And when you do this, an X will appear in the upper left corner of the thumbnail. You go ahead and click on that X and that space will disappear.